So today we're going to be installing NSX Manager 3.1 in our vCenter environment. We have two clusters, one for compute, one for management. We'll be installing the manager here on the, on the management cluster. So we'll right click here, click deploy OVF template, local file, click upload files. And I've already got the appliance downloaded here, the OVA file. And we'll let that uh, get uploaded successfully and, uh, and proceed with the wizard. All right, once the file is uploaded, we'll click next. Virtual machine name is going to be nsxmgr-01a.core.local. This is the machine name that will show up in vCenter. We want it in region A01 here. Going to deploy it in the management cluster, so we'll keep that there. Okay, that looks good. We'll click next. And I think we're going to go here with an extra small. And we're going to choose thin provisioned here. Uh, this is a large appliance. Even, even the extra small, you know, requires 300 gigabits. Uh, so we're going to choose a thin provision here uh, as we don't have quite enough of space to cover that, um, a full thick provisioned appliance. Thick provisioned is recommended though for production environment. Um, but uh, in this case, for the purposes of this lab, uh, we're going to stick with thin, uh, thin provisioned. And our network is going to be the MGMT network. And here we can start to put in our custom settings for the appliance, including uh, the root and admin passwords, host name, IP address. This is the audit password. You don't have to fill this one out, but uh, if you plan on using the audit account, um, I want to go ahead and do that. Uh, NSX MGR 01A core local is our host name. NSX manager is our role. And IP address is 192.168.110.42. Netmask is slash 24, so it's 255.255.255.0. And 192.168.110.1 is our default gateway. DNS serverless, that's going to be 110.10, like that. Core.local is our domain. And NTP server is 192.168.100.1. And we're going to enable SSH and allow root SSH logins. Uh, we typically wouldn't do this, uh, allow root SSH logins for a production environment. Uh, but since it's a lab, why not? And you don't have to worry about these properties. As it says, these are internal parameters. Don't set them. We'll click Next. And... Okay, I think we're ready. We'll click finish.